Hello everybody and um, welcome back to my channel. I thought this would be the introduction to my, um, let me just put my hair up actually. But yeah, I thought this would be the introduction to my like moving in to second year uni thing. I filmed, I filmed one clip the other day and it was going to be a day in the life and then I just forgot to film my night out. So I include that clip now. Oh. Hello everybody, long time no see. Um, <laughs> uh, welcome back to my channel. Um, this is a very spontaneous video. This is very um, going to be a very chaotic <laughs> video. Um, ignore the friends that I have on my face. My skin is so bad. But basically, okay, so today is Friday. Me and Ella were going to go out tomorrow, Saturday. I ordered an outfit, it was see-through, so I was going to order another one, and then I got given my shifts at work, and I thought I was only working on, like, like one shift, or I was doing, like, two shifts but combined, so I'd be fine to go out. No. Turns out I'm not. Am I even working tonight? No, I'm not. Thank God. Um, so I quickly had to message her, like, we can't go out tonight. No, nope, can't go out tomorrow night. So then I was like, why don't we go out tonight? So we've changed to tonight. But tonight is Megan's leaving do um, because she's going to uni tomorrow because um, she's going earlier than like the rest of us and so we were like we'll go out tonight, we'll go to the meal and we'll go out but we wanted to get Megan some leaving presents um, so we're just going to get a little thing, we're just going to get like a photo frame and a photo of us and then a little travel mug um, kind of thing, she loves coffee so I'm probably making no sense. I'm really stressed. <laughs> so I've already had a shower today. I've cut off my hair for like the meal and I just put it up. Um, so I'm guessing tonight we're going to have to go with it up. Um, but yes, we're going to go, me and Ella are going to go to the meal and then come back, get change it, go out. Um, hopefully we have enough time because we were going to go for like a couple of drinks and then into a club. But if we go to a club, I think we're going to go to a dressy club maybe. Um, which is not many on a Friday in Bristol. The only real club, proper club, is Brands. And I don't know. I don't even have any jeans because I left them in Cornwall. So, yeah, I'm just currently on the way to Yate, Yate, to get Megan's stuff. Um, and then I'm going to quickly go back and do my face. Um, hopefully, my skin's become really dry because it got sunburn. And I've never had dry skin before, it's still oily, but like I've been flaking here and on my forehead and then obviously this big guy has come along and this little one I've had to pop like four times. So yeah, it's been quite stressful, don't know what to wear. Mm, I have no jeans so I kind of have to go with a skirt, but then I have a nice option that I could wear, but then I, I have these new heels, these new lilac heels from Pull and Bear and they're stunning so I want to kind of wear them also oh my god is this actually the fucking traffic why is there traffic there's never traffic here it's half two yeah I hate when you have to get ready for things in a rush like I could have done this earlier I don't even know if I'll be able to get Megan's mug so hopefully you're gonna probably oh no you're gonna probably fall why is there so much traffic? Yeah, as you can tell, I'm just a bit stressed. I was going to do a um, day in the life vlog today, actually, to be fair. But I didn't start it this morning because I just thought it would be a bit boring and like there's not much happening. But now there is. So this can be a... I've just, I've just word vomited because I just, I just feel stressed. But anyway, this week I've been down in Cornwall. We go every year since we were little to a place called Mother Ivy's, um, which is near Padstow. So we went there, um, and it was very fun. It was very sunny. It was on the bank holiday, one of the sunniest bank holidays it's been, which is nice because it's always fucking freezing and pissing it down with rain. But yeah, so I hope this video is interesting. You can just you'll be able to see just what a state I am. How stressed, easily stressed I get. But I also got an order through, so I will show you that if 
I'm once I'm ready. I don't know whether to do eyeshadow. Um, I ordered some lashes for tomorrow. I didn't fucking need to, but at least I've got them now for uni. Um, but oh, and I ordered a bag. Oh god, honestly, I I need my credit card or my debit card taken away from me. I actually I, I'm just spending all the time, and I'm still now tonight like, what the fuck am I meant to wear? Because I just don't no i don't like anything but i want to wear these lilac heels so i'm wondering whether to wash like my white bodysuit or something and um wear that with jeans and lilac heels or like my mum jeans or wear one of my pretty tops with like a white skirt which would probably be better in this heat and some lilac heels but then i don't know how i if i like how it looks underwear well not a lot i bought two pieces but for me that's a lot i never buy underwear so i bought that i'll show you it later i'm literally just rambling because i i haven't filmed in so long and it was like a makeup tutorial what i filmed last which you can't really chat that much in um so i haven't uploaded the napa vlog i do apologize it may not ever go up i don't know um but like to see for me because I would like to upload like twice a week I just don't know what to film that is my dilemma so oh look how bad I look she's not attractive I'm just hoping Yate has like a coffee mug I want to get like a bamboo coffee mug from X mm. oh in other news as well um I have a boyfriend Yes, quick turnover, you know, in like two videos ago, I was like, I'm now single. Yes, we now have a new person that's joined my life. <laughs> oh, don't say it like that. But yeah, so that's cool. That's exciting. That's fun. These people are probably actually quite confused. So if no one cares about your life that much. But I was going from just one person and then I've started posting a new person. Um, me and my ex broke up like mid June yes a week before Iron Apple um and then in Iron Apple I met this um person and we've seen each other since it, there's no bad blood between me and my ex he's happy he's with someone now I think he's with his um ex-girlfriend and I am now with Connor so it's all good it's fucking scorching. It's so hot. What the fuck? I think it's just because my car's in. I'm really actually sad that I'm working until midnight tomorrow. Like, I was so excited for, like, a proper night out. This clip has been nine minutes. Fuck. Oh, I hate editing drive with me because I just chat so much. But, yeah, I'll end it with this. Yeah, I'm, I'm just sad that I'm working tomorrow till midnight because I was excited to just get ready, chill, get ready. We were going to film a drink with, like, a drink with us and I could have worn something like a nice outfit but you know at least we're going out tonight I may wear trainers why am I trying to wear heels I just want to wear trainers oh, I don't know what to wear right I will update you later on see you in the next clip I was just shaving my upper lip and cut myself I don't want to stop bleeding Um, but yeah, after that we then went out, we went for Megan's meal, then me and Ella went out and then I had work and this week I basically have work every day but on Wednesday we, um, will be the 4th of September and we're allowed the keys for my second year house on the 1st of September which was yesterday um, but I could go down Wednesday and I'm going to take down the stuff I'll show you now which um, it's basically the stuff that I had in my hauls last year, like everything that I had last year, I'm going to take down 
put in my room and see what it kind of looks like, see what else I need. Like I might need a rug, like a bigger one because my room's like the biggest in the house. Um, put a rug, everything like that, put it all in. And then I will officially be moving in on the 17th of September. And because I have an induction on the 18th of September, don't know when I'm actually start, starting my course yet, but <laughs> so yeah, I'll just show you everything now. So this is basically everything. Um, I've got like plates and stuff in here. Don't actually know what I've got in there. In here, I've just got like um, my bin and stuff. Got all my kitchen stuff in here. I'll do like a proper unboxing when I'm undoing it all, maybe. Um, I mean, it's all the same as what I had last year. Um, in here, I've got bathroom stuff in my little laundry basket. Got my lamp, got that. Got my stuff to go in my room, like decorations. Um, basically, I'm going to be having to buy a lot more because, I mean, I've brought, come back and in my old Jimmy room, you might remember I had these boxes that were up on the shelf. Um, however, when I've brought them back now, they just make things so tidy in here so there's I don't want to then take them as storage to my next place although I do have more room in my next place um I want to buy like just cheaper uglier containers just to put like shoes in and stuff and just put them under my bed um because my room is actually bigger than my room here like because this is my room at home in Bristol and so like this um i want my room there to just be very white clean obviously i'm gonna have to have pinks in it because that's my theme last year pinks and greys but i want like plants i want loads of plants and so i'm gonna go to ikea um the only things i need to get really like that i know i need to get um are some plants some uh mugs like i have mugs i want the ones that like you can get in the how would you say it? like you can stack them and then it comes with like a stand so I want to get all of like ones of those just so it's all neat I want to get a sugar coffee and tea canister things because I've ordered a bunch of flavored coffee um also need to get some new towels because I brought my ones back here and I've been using them here and they've just got a bit gross and I kind of want like a bath sheet like a big towel rather than um like a little one because it's going to be cold in this house because obviously it'll be winter and heating costs a lot and stuff like that also need some pots to put like um like this pot can you kind of see like that to put um like uh eye bud to remove my makeup in need one of them but that's not like major so we're gonna go down and put all of the ma like main stuff in and all of the kitchen stuff will then be put in and stuff but I want to get the mugs from Dunelm and there's a Dunelm in Bristol so we might need to go there on Wednesday before we go to Portsmouth hmm but yeah I'm quite sad to be going back because it means I'm not gonna have any money <laughs> because I still haven't got a transfer to Tesco hasn't worked they're just shit really shit um apparently they're not doing it because they've run out of money um ran out of money uh so i'm saving well trying to save money for like if i want to go on trips and stuff like that because we're thinking of booking like budapest and i want to go to like prague things like this so that's the only thing i'm going to be sad about is that i won't be working i won't be getting money but yeah also, another disclaimer, ignore my face. This is not chocolate or food on my face. Um, this is a spot that I've continued to be picking, hence why it's red. Um, and this is, so basically, I shave my face. Um, I don't have stubble, I don't have anything, I don't have a hairy face, really. But I just do it just so makeup goes on a lot smoother and you don't end up with like, when you're rubbing in your foundation, like the hairs go up and then they stick out in the sun and you can like I mean you couldn't really see it anyway but I just like to um so I was doing that up here and I split my lip open so that was fun that happened the other day when I was getting ready to go out from the 
clip where I was driving after that yeah I split my lip and it was bleeding for about three hours so that was fun okay so I got a couple of things um today from Primark um Poundland and I think that's it so I got this from I don't really know um Dunelm put pens in I already had one but it was too small this Poundland more hangers from Primark this Poundland because I already have some this from uh Dunelm from Primark. Just thought I'd update you on my purchases. Yeah, I think that's all I got today. Okay, so it's currently Wednesday. It's about 10 o'clock. Um, I've just finished work. I started at 6 and I've just put on like mascara, done my hair and we're about to go to Portsmouth, um, get the keys and everything and put all my stuff in. I've got loads of stuff. Apart from I had all of these storage things like um, rose gold things to put books in and everything like that and my bin for my bathroom. God knows what else got chucked out. I'll have to watch, rewatch my uni videos and see what else got chucked out. But yeah, my mum chucked them out without realising. She put them in the garage and just chucked them out. So. Okay, so I've just made a coffee and I just want to show what I'm wearing today. So I've got this bralette on from um, ASOS that I wear, so you can kind of see it with this top, which is from, oh, I actually don't know. Right, I remember now, Pull and Bear. This is from Pull and Bear. Jeans are also Pull and Bear. These are Primark. This cardigan is Primark. And then bag is oh, Zara. However, I may change um into that top from Primark just because it looks a bit too kind of see the weather it looks a bit too warm for a cardigan but I want to be cozy so I don't know but yeah two weeks ago maybe I was outside like literally didn't want to move into uni again but I'm really excited mainly just so I can decorate my new house um but the um people message like phone me like oh we'll meet you at the property because we need to let you in and i was like well yeah but i thought i was going to the place to get a um the key and then they were like oh, are you staying or are you just dropping your stuff off i was like dropping my stuff off and they were like oh okay but i hope they don't stay whilst i'm like putting my stuff in because i kind of want to like film me putting it in and also just redecorate a bit you know make it look nice do all of that stuff but I don't know how I'll be able to do that with them like waiting around so hopefully they'll just let me in and let me into the correct room and then give me that key um because obviously they don't know which room I'm having so hopefully that'll be fine um someone from Tesco emailed me and was like oh should you could you come down for a an interview today and I'm like yeah but not at 10 at night I'm not gonna come at 10 at night but yeah so that's that work this morning went really quick um yeah it was really good really quick I haven't worn makeup in ages literally can't remember the last time I wore makeup I'm looking here instead of here sorry but yeah, I burnt my nose as well, a little bit brown in um, Cornwall. Um, so I'm just exposing my entire breast, but you can kind of see like a tan line-ish. Ish. Um, I didn't really get that many tan lines. So I'm just trying to show. I'm just going to go. So it's important. Yeah. Yeah. One room.
toilet, the lounge, lovely, kitchen, hi, with all my stuff, lovely, this is garden, small little garden, not too big, it's a bit gross in the lounge, a light, this is Tate's room. What are they? Room. Another bathroom. And next room. And then my room is down here. Okay, so this is mine, and I'm gonna have that instead of the sofa because. So it will be handy, but I just don't want it here. I need somewhere to put my laundry basket, and then this area will look nice and cute. I'm gonna hang that up. Um, these go on the bed. Sure. Got that there. Don't have anything for this to go on top, and make it look pretty. But I've got my little thing. Got my bin holder. Little plant. This full of just random stuff got this copper thing full of all of my bright pens that will have black pens academic year another notebook and then on here obviously this goes with the pink theme and then i'll get a pillow to go on there that's not my bin i'm gonna get rid of that and then I need a bigger one for down there i think okay so these have gone here this we're gonna put a big throw on because it looks better with it and yeah Okay, so we're just on our way back from Portsmouth. It was just a quick trip, just to put all that stuff in. Um, this, I've wrote a list of what else I need. Why is this going to be um, But yeah, so we're just on our way back. Yeah, it was quite a good trip. I can now see what I've got. I'll film when I next go there. So yeah. Okay, we went so I basically, <laughs> my mum laughed when I told her this. I've done a design for my, um, sorry, exposing myself just have a shower um, for my shelves um, to make them look pretty so this is my design <laughs> um, I did used to do art um, this doesn't replicate that um, <laughs> but yes yeah, so I've just got all of these so basically what my idea is most of the stuff I've got I just need to get two bigger plants like fluffier plants for um, it and I'm gonna get them for my Kia and stuff and I need to get a hangy plant which I've got up there. Um, on there I'm going to have, I don't know how much it's gonna fit, I'm gonna get two photo frames I think. Well, I'll get three just in case um, and then I can put it somewhere else and I'm also going to be getting a map from this company that I have that are um, kindly uh, sending it to me um, called Mapperful. So that should be coming once I've actually ordered it. So I'm going to use this, and I've, I've put in these little um, fairy lights, and they are on at the moment, but you can't see because it's dark. Can you see? No, you can't. Um, <laughs> so that's going to go on one shelf. Then I may put this, just a little Pandora box, a bit dirty, a bit grubby, but like it has the pink, the white and the black, which will tie in. 
Um, I may also put this photos there. Um, I might actually not, just because it's green. It won't go with the theme of it. Um, I'm then also going to put this little Sephora bag next to, I'm going to get, um, also because this is black with the pink, um, I have weed diffusers from, they're only from Lidl, no, Aldi, and they smell amazing, and I have some here, I also have a black Yankee candle, so I might take that as well, but I don't want to take so much out of this room that it then looks bare, um, so I'm going to buy another one of those Aldi weed diffusers, because they look really nice and classy, and it will go next to this little Sephora bag. I've then got this little Ted Baker box, um, which I'm going to put next to this little guy. I used to have this next to my Tiffany box, and then he matched, but I'm not going to... I need to replace my Tiffany necklace, so I need that kind of here. But yeah, so I'm going to put those together. I'm then going to put this with these fake flowers in, which are currently up on my... Um, Mantel shelf, mantel shelf, my one by my window. They're currently there, and I bought them for last year. I'm going to stick them in here. Um, then I've got a stealing this from my mum. A black thing with a little to go with the black. And then I've got my little sentence a day, which I did start off writing in. <laughs> Mm, I don't want to read that, but <laughs> I should have probably filled this in a bit more, but yeah, I'm going to put that because it's rose gold and pink. And once that's all there with like photo frames and um, like the pictures and the plants, it will all kind of come together because I don't want it to look too busy. But I want it to be very colour coordinated and very just pretty. And I'm also going to use that S that's there as well on the top. Um, so I'll have like the hanging plan, my map, then the S, then some pictures, and they will go down because I'm not going to use the bottom shelf unless I need to put like a blanket there or a throw and just fold it up and put it there just for to look pretty. So yeah, I thought I'd just update you on that. I'm going to try and get photo frames today from Poundland. I also ordered all of these because basically, ooh, um, Megan has took a photo of her at uni and she had her little mugs and then she had these but in a um, like a wooden thing that popped open with like a hundred of them that was 15 pounds so I thought let's go for the three pound option and then just put them in my little coffee thing at uni um, so I've got these for uni so there's like cookie dough hazelnut almonds gingerbread which would be nice in winter Irish cream mint chocolate um, so yeah, I've got, and then I've just made the caramel, no, yeah, caramel popcorn, and it literally smells of popcorn. Like, it's, this smell reminds me of when I went to Mexico and stayed, um, with, like, a Mexican family for three weeks, and all of their mouths smelt like this, literally identical. You'd walk past the cinemas and I mean at the time I was very ill so I hated the smell um but now like it literally just reminds me of that just all of the like proper popcorn oh my god that's crazy <gasps> it's a bit smells very sickly so I don't know what it's gonna be like but yeah I'm excited to have all these and the gingerbread oh gingerbread oh. and they're only like three pounds and I just got them on Amazon um when I typed in it's their beanies flavored coffee so Mm, I may buy the big one if these are nice. I mean, because some of them I'm not going to drink. Coconut Delight. I don't really like coconut. But, yeah. Okay, I just wanted to show you guys that I bought some more stuff the other day um, for the room. So I've got um, these from last year. I found them. Um, and then I've got two photo frames and then a wooden one in here. So photo frames are done. They're complete. And I went into Poundland. Got another one of these to go on the side. Um, I think I'm gonna have to be getting rid of one of my chest of drawers because um, some of the girls don't have any and I have two. Um, if I do, then I'll get rid of the white one, um, which I really like the white one, but I can put my mirror there instead. So yeah, I then got, because I've wanted a coffee cup, but the ones that I've seen that have been quite expensive um, look like this, but they have, like there's no, Nothing to hold it, so if you put it in your bag, 
but I thought this was pretty and it was like one pound so I mean may as well um then I got this from Poundland which was one pound which is crazy so yeah I got this to put my jewelry on my gold jewelry and then I've been wanting a lunch box because I'm going to be going um to the library for the whole day like I'm going to treat uni this year like a nine to five job kind of thing so I will be needing my lunch and I need one that fits a knife and fork cleanly so that works out and I got it in yellow um they had yellow or blue but I like how it has different compartments on the inside as well oh yeah there's three compartments that's good um I think that's everything I got I spent five pounds so I don't know what else I bought because there's four things here so that may have been two pounds but I remember scanning it and it went through as one so I'm not sure but yeah okay so I have been at work all day it's currently Saturday and I'm um I started at six and I finished at 2 15 and I'm heading to Ikea today um this jumper just arrived so it's just like a black jumper but then it kind of goes in like corsety and then like a bit baggy sleeves and then it comes out here so I thought for winter it'd be quite nice like just jazz it up a bit so I'm just wearing this because I don't know wanted to with this belt um from uh, ASOS I think or pretty little thing pretty little thing I think um these jeans pull and bear I need to get some jeans that are lighter than this to be honest and then my Javianas and this bag ignore that that's my blanket <laughs> my baby blanket and then this bag from Zara so yeah that's my outfit but we're currently going to um Ikea for plants we're also going to go to Maslan and get some towels the range find some bits there I think we're going to get like pillows from the range so stuff like that so I'm very excited I've gone through all of my clothes um today and I've put them into two suitcases I've got I've like basically just packed my um jumpers and the stuff that I don't need um right now so I'll have to probably put some more stuff into another suitcase I will have three suitcases and one big night bag to take down with me, clothing wise. Imagine me bringing all that back. Can't wait. We are running out of petrol, ladies and gents. done for uni uh, and I went in well I thought they opened at half nine no I'm guessing they open at nine or people just come earlier and um it was absolutely packed so I was like great I'm literally driving on the wrong side of the road I got in and I am on my period and it's like really heavy um and I put my this is probably TMI but I mean I don't care um everyone gets a period well girls um so i put my tampon in at like uh quarter to nine and normally when i've just started my period um i can only leave it in for like an hour maximum like hour and a half by the two hour mark it started leaking everywhere so i was like i literally and my stomach started hurting and I was thinking, fuck, by the time I sit, and I, I sat down in one of the seats whilst they then finish and I was thinking, no, because I'm having infills, which normally actually takes longer and I wanted to shorten them and I just, just didn't want the stress. So I'm just currently editing this video. My voice is gone. Um, it's currently like a week later. Um, 
bit of being moved in and just thought I'd end it. Um, if you want a actual like proper finished room and house tour, let me know because we've done quite a lot to it. Um, my room is now completely done. Um, 